IQ is a really interesting concept. It's, it's the idea that there's some measurable property that can distinguish one person's intellect from another. Well, we set out to test this idea that if you uh, assess people's cognitive function on many different tests, is it true that some people will be better than other people overall? Is, is it that there's a single factor that can distinguish between people? So the first thing that we did was we took 12 tasks of the type typically considered to uh, depend on general intelligence and we adapted them so that we could run them on a cognitive testing website. Then we adapted the same tasks so that we could run people in a brain imaging uh, scanner whilst undertaking those, those same, same 12 tests. What we found was that instead of one form of intelligence, there are actually several different forms of intelligence. And moreover, those different forms of intelligence are each related to the functioning of a different circuit in the brain. So a really key point here is not that we've come up with a better way of measuring IQ than somebody else, but that we've shown categorically that you cannot sum up the difference between people in terms of one number, and that's what's really important here. Now we need to go forward and work out how we can assess the differences between people, and that, that'll be something for future studies.